AFC West predictions, I'm going to go ahead and discuss what I think is going to happen in the AFC West. That's your Kansas City Chiefs, San Diego Chargers, Oakland Raiders, and Denver Broncos. Um, this is completely unresearched, unplanned, actually coming up with this right as I'm talking right now. So uh, take that for what you will. I think the San Diego Chargers are the clear-cut favorite to take this division, not because of their coach. I think their coach is terrible. Uh, not because of their talent, because their talent underachieves on a regular basis every year. Um, and not because of their depth, although I do think they have pretty solid depth at a couple of key positions. Antonio Gates, technically this guy's going to be banged up for the rest of his career uh, with plantar fasciitis. So I just don't know how I feel about Gates at tight end. Philip Rivers is phenomenal, but unless he's got a bunch of people really focused around him, I don't see how they put it together. With that being said, I think the rest of the division is just downright awful, and uh, just head-to-head -head on paper, San Diego should take this division by two or three games, and their schedule actually favors that potentially happening. Coming in second in this division this, uh, this season, I'm taking the Oakland Raiders. I really think they surprised people last year. If they could pick a quarterback and stick with it, I think they're going to make a run at 500. But uh, as far as actually being a playoff contender, uh, I think they would need too many things to go their way this season to make that happen. That being said, I do think they are a step ahead of the Denver Broncos. Now, Denver, I just don't understand this fascination with Tim Tebow. Uh, he's not an NFL quarterback. I don't care how much you like the guy or how many jerseys he sells. Kyle Orton should be your guy. Kyle Orton is an above-average quarterback. And with the right weapons, Kyle can do some damage. I don't really like what Denver has at wide receiver, and I don't necessarily care for what they've done on defense. I also, I'm really not sure how I feel about their coaching hire, but, you know, I, I, Kyle Orton should be able to lead this team to 500, as far as I'm concerned. But I think the Raiders, having swept the division last year, I think they're going to go pretty close to doing it again this year. Then at the bottom of the division, I have your Kansas City Chiefs. They're downright awful. I don't know what happened last year, but that team sucks. Uh, they will probably come in dead last this year. Uh, I predict injuries across the board to pretty much every key player on that team. Uh, the Kansas City Chiefs probably have no hope, um, and really Los Angeles should try to get them to move as far as I'm concerned. I think they would be a great option to move out to L.A. Uh, to play at Farmer's Field which they're um, going to go ahead and build in Los Angeles and wait for a team to arrive. Um, so that's my prediction in the AFC West. Uh, I'm going to go ahead and take the San Diego Chargers. Big surprise.